On behalf of Tuxedo Labs and Saber Interactive, I'd like to introduce you to Teardown, a sandbox game that features a simulated and fully destructible voxel world. Built with a cutting edge custom game engine, beautiful environments are brought to life in a one of a kind way using interactive and realistic physics. Teardown features a bunch of ways to play. There are story campaigns, sandbox and creative modes, as well as a bunch of user-created mods you can install to completely change your experience. Teardown's campaign hands you a struggling demolition business under a pile of debt. To save your business, you start accepting jobs from a variety of shady characters who task you with things like blowing up private property, stealing competitor secrets, and a bunch of other questionable activities. But these jobs come with risk. You'll have to plan your escape route carefully, or the police will catch you in the act. As you succeed and take on more work, you'll start to turn a profit and gather an arsenal of super destructive tools to conquer even bigger jobs. From sledgehammer to blowtorch, rocket launcher to nitroglycerin, you're bound to find the right tool for each job. And if you're interested in using these tools in a less structured environment, Teardown features a freeform sandbox mode. No heists to plan, no time pressures, just a bunch of levels where you can mess around with physics and explosions. You can also toggle on creative mode, opening up a new suite of tools for building whatever you can dream up out of brick, glass, and the various other materials found in the game world. Everything you create then exists as part of the fully simulated and destructible world. We look forward to seeing the crazy creations that you can come up with. If you want to see some of the more complex creations that players have already come up with, then checking out our selection of user-created mods is just for you. What started as an indie physics simulation project has become a world of wondrous creativity. We look forward to seeing what the players will create or the clever ways they'll think up to destroy when Teardown comes to consoles later this year.